Hi guys, my name is Hermit in the Forest. This is my unboxing of The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Collector's Edition. Uh, this game is uh, a role-playing game featuring third-person view. Uh, that is the third game in the Witcher series. Uh, you play as Gerald of Rivia, who is a Witcher, a professional monster slayer who is hired by mighty figures of the harsh medieval world that he lives in, like kings, sorceresses and such. And in, his, in this game he has to deal with his past and fight many enemies, solve many quests, like in all Witcher games. Uh, the collector's edition is very big and has a lot of stuff inside, so let's take a look at it. This is the front cover, now I will turn the box and on, you will see all the sides. Here on the back side you can see uh, Geralt battling a griffin that is uh, a plastic figurine that is present in this collector's edition. And on this side you can see the collector's edition content. There is the box as you can see, the game of course, soundtrack, game menu, uh, compendium, art book, steel book, stickers, world map, uh, medallion and of course the figurine. There are also some pictures from the game. Now I will remove the outer sleeve around the big box. As you can see there is just plain uh, black cardboard box with a Witcher logo on it and that has a red top. Now I open uh, the box and you will see the signatures of the game developers. Uh, those signatures are not um, are just printed, it's not that they will sign every box but uh, it's the printed signatures. Let's take a look at it. So, I hope you saw those signatures. Inside the huge box there is this also very big box that is black and has Witcher logo on it. It opens like this and inside there is first of the stuff. Okay, first thing that is in this big box is the art book that is really amazing. It contains very nice art concepts and landscapes from the game. It is really one of the nicest art books I ever, I've ever seen. You know, table of contents and now take a look at these gorgeous pictures of medieval landscape. So the town, here this is something really beautiful, this fresco. Some nature sceneries as well. Very nice and medieval castle. Allies of Geralt and enemies. Some important figures from this game. 
the invading Nilfgaardian army from the south. And members of the wild hunt were chasing Geralt, the army of death. Some enemies that you will fight and encounter in this game. Really beautiful art and scary. So, that is the art book. Next thing in the box is this Witcher medallion that is very massive and heavy. A talisman of the Witcher on chain that you can wear that Geralt has around his neck and now you can too. Next, there is steel book for the game DVDs. I put them inside, originally this was empty and the DVDs were in a different place, but I put them in. So you can see there is four DVDs for game discs with the game. Okay, so there's a steel book. Then there is this box with game and bonus content. On the back side you can see pictures on the game and text about the game. Inside there are two plastic boxes, DVD boxes. First plastic DVD box is this one. Again on the back side pictures and text about the game and inside originally there were three of those four CDs. Then there is the Witcher Universe Compendium with many useful info. There is also a code for the Witcher Battle Arena and here you can see the table of contents just a few pages something about the ancient times history of the game races and people inhabiting the world various Witcher factions of course Geralt is of the wolf faction something about Geralt of Rivia and his closest friends. Also his previous deeds, what he did in Witcher 1 and 2 games. Various things about gameplay and some credits. Okay, this is the back side. Well, then there is, of course, the game menu, looks like this, and has info about installation of the game, how to play the game, and yeah, some customer support. On the back side, there is a GOG code, because this game is distributed through GOG. Uh, then there is another uh, plastic DVD with soundtrack. On the back side you can see the tracklist. And inside there is the soundtrack. Originally there was also disc 4 of this game, but here is the soundtrack. Then there are stickers. Some Thank you card from uh, CD Projekt Red and a paper map of the game world. It is very nice. Very nice paper map with the game locations 
that you will visit in this game. Good. And the last thing, of course, is the big figurine. I will show it to you now. It is in this big uh, in this big polystyrene protection with Witcher logo on it, and inside I have to put it, assemble it together. There is. I have to put a sword in Geralt's hand at first, and I have to put a tail in the Griffin's bottom. Okay, so here you can see the figurine Geralt battling a Griffin. I will show it to you from all the sides. Here he is. Yeah, really beautiful, standing on some rock. And, yeah. Really nice. Now you can see it from a distance and yeah I think it looks very nice and will be a nice decoration on a table or somewhere else. Okay so and that is all that was in this huge box. I thank you very much for watching this video.